Hello, we've seen some torrential rain in the last 48 hours and whilst the rain warnings may have expired, we still have a number of flood warnings in place. Now, the heaviest of the rain is moving away eastwards from the flooded areas of Wales and northwest England, seeing something drier arriving from the west. And all of this rain has come courtesy of this strip of cloud. It's a very slow moving front, which whilst at the moment it's moving away eastwards, will eventually start to return its way westwards later on today. So here's a setup through daylight hours on Sunday, this very slow moving front continuing to feed further outbreaks of rain across parts of England and Wales and then trying to slide its way north and eastward. So we see some brighter skies developing across Wales and southwest England. A fine day across Northern Ireland, some spells of sunshine and some sunshine extending across much of Scotland, although we could just catch a few showers still for the Northern and Western Isles. So a closer look at four o'clock in the afternoon, still further outbreaks of rain across central and eastern England. It's going to take its time to clear, but the winds are lighter, temperatures are lower than yesterday. Some spells of sunshine for northwest England, northern Ireland running up into much of Scotland. May just find a little bit more cloud and some rain for the far east of Scotland through this afternoon. Now that front moves away south and eastwards overnight and then it starts to push its way back westwards later on, perhaps getting as far west as the eastern side of Wales. Behind the rain, we'll see some clearer spells, perhaps temperatures getting close to freezing across the glens of Scotland. And that front is still with us through tomorrow morning. Eventually, it does start to move away eastwards, but we're still going to find more cloud outbreaks of rain for a time, particularly through the morning. Further north and west, it should be mainly dry, some spells of sunshine and temperatures tomorrow between 11 and 17 Celsius, so a cooler feel for many. This area of high pressure is across much of England and Wales as we go into Tuesday, but notice these fronts starting to topple in from the Atlantic. That's going to increase the cloud, bring out breaks of rain into Northern Ireland, Northern and Western Scotland, perhaps the far north of England through the afternoon, maybe into North Wales, but rain amounts nowhere near what we've been seeing in the last 48 hours. Ahead of this, still some spells of sunshine, temperatures up to 16 or 17 Celsius. Behind that front, more like 11 or 12. So for the week ahead, things are generally looking quieter. It won't be as warm. It'll be driest in the south and the east, but some rain at times in the north and the west.